Hi, in this video we're going to show you a way to hide or remove a drive from the safely eject devices down here in the system tray. So if you have a removable drive plugged in and you go here and you go to this icon here to safely remove hardware and eject media, it'll show you what you have here. So in my case I don't want this flash drive to be here, this F drive. So if you want to hide it we're going to show you how to do it. Alright, so to do this we're going to do a simple registry edit here. So I have some instructions here. So you want to open up Registry Editor and go to this key here. So we'll copy this. Type in Reg Edit here in the search box. Paste it in the address bar so you don't have to actually browse to it. Press Enter. Okay, so now over here on the right, we want to make a new D word value called No Drives. So we'll copy that. You just right click in a blank area or right click on Explorer. New D word 32 bit value. Paste that in. Make sure you type it exactly like this with the capital letters and no space. All right, so now since this is our F drive, we want to enter a value of 32. So G is 64, H128, and so on. Just double the number as you go up. Okay, so we're going to double click this, change it to decimal. That's important. Put in 32. Click OK. All right, so now we need to log off and back on again. All right, so now we go back here. You can see we do not have our F drive any longer. And then, of course, if you want to put it back, just go back to Reg Edit. You could come here and delete this if you want, or you could probably come here and set it to zero if you want to just save it here for later. So let's actually just delete it. Okay, we'll log off and back on again. Let's come back here, and now you can see it's back. All right, so once again, just go to this key, make a D word value called no drives, change it to decimal for the value, enter the correct number here to match your drive letter, and that's all there is to it. And then if you want to hide multiple drives, you could actually add some numbers together. So I'll put this information in the description, and then you could try it out for yourself. All right, thanks for watching, and be sure to subscribe. Thank <laughs> you.